hello, hello, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. So, today is my second ever Aldi's haul. Um, I went at the beginning of the summer. And now I'm going again. Uh, at the end of fall here. Well, beginning of fall here. So, some of this stuff I've never tried from Aldi's before. So I got it just because I wanted to see what it tasted like. First thing, um, steak fries, crinkle cut fries, seasoned french fries, and potato puffs. I got one of each just so that we could try them all so that I knew which ones we do like and which ones we don't like and what I'm not going to be buying again. Now I bought, we always use two packages of cheddar worst, cheddar brats, um, whenever I make anything that has hot dogs in it whether it's spaghetti hot dogs or just hot dogs in general we always use two packages so I got two of the cheddar brats just so I could try them and see what we think of the ones from there I got um, their ham so that me and my daughter can find out how we like the ham from there and then I got a, they had chocolate chip loaves now we've never tried it I figured we'd get it and we'd try it and just see what we thought, think of it. Um, now this is Raisin Cinnamon Swirl Bread. Uh, my daughter loves this stuff, but we've never tried this stuff from Aldi's. So I got that just to see what she thought of that. And then um, we really like these ones. These are the Hawaiian Sweet Rolls. So I grabbed two packages of those. I have an alarm going off. I got to win over all of this with you. I need to get it put away in my uh, freezer. So we'll be back, you guys, for the next round. Alright, guys. Next round of stuff. Um, my son saw these there. They were uh, five bucks. Um, I generally don't buy this kind of stuff. But they come home after school. And my son has the early lunch. My daughter has the late lunch. So, my son comes home starved. And I generally don't like to feed my kids this kind of junk food. However, he's never tried these before because, like I said, I don't let my kids do junky food like this. He has tried be uh, pizza rolls. But when he saw these at Aldi's and they were $5, he asked for these for after school snack. And I said, sure, go ahead. And then I got Dino Nuggets. These are really good ones. Uh, we tried these and I bought them in my first haul. When I went to Aldi's, they are really good, really, really good. So I got these for my kids and then... I make these along with french fries and salad and boom. Um, I wouldn't say well-rounded meal, but simple, fast, easy meal if mom's been busy all day doing stuff. Next, I got their brand of stuffing mix. I got a cornbread and a chicken because I always like to mix my stuffings. So I did those. Um, my son wanted hot chocolate and they were a buck twenty five buck twenty nine. So I let him get a couple of hot chocolates. And then I decided to try their shells and cheese instead of just the macaroni and cheese that craft that I buy sometimes. Um, we're gonna try those. Um, I'm gonna make my mac and cheese hot dish. Um, I'm gonna use those hot dogs that I got from all these in the last clip um, cut them all up make it together make a hot dish with vegetables um, and try it out and see what it tastes like um, see if we like it out of this shells and cheese um, and I'll bring you along and film a video of it and then this is cheese dip because um, when we make uh, the broccoli carrot cauliflower mixed vegetables for uh, dinner we like to bake them in the oven with uh, cheese sauce on top of them and that's how I get my kids to well 
my daughter will eat vegetables but it's how one of the ways to get my son to eat his vegetables put a little bit of cheese on top of the broccoli and the cauliflower and the carrots and he devours them all right that's this round i got um i think only one more round of things to show you so we'll be back all right guys there is the last of it um i got and i want to try some of their cream style corn now this is the only canned uh, vegetable I buy for my family. Um, actually, I take that back. Once or twice a year during the winter, I make hamburger soup. My grandma's hamburger soup. And I also buy a can, a single can of rutabagas whenever I make the soup. But I mean, this is the only vegetable that we have on a regular basis these three cans alone will last me three or four months all right next i picked up mini sesame sweet chocolate morsels i want to find out what their chocolate chips taste like i got the mini ones because my son likes the mini chocolate chips in his chocolate chip cookies i got two bottles of lemon juice um my kids have started to take to when they're making their tea that I make for them. I can up a bunch of tea. I put it on the shelf. You've seen that. My kids have taken to, instead of using two jars of tea, they use one jar of tea and some lemon juice. And they make a half lemonade, half tea mix. And they really enjoy it. So they've been going through lemon juice like crazy. And then sugar it's the time of year where i'm going to be doing a lot of canning of fruit so i needed to make sure i had a bunch of sugar and it's also that time of year where i'm just going to start baking breakfast breads so i need to make sure i have lots of sugar around now i've done the price um comparisons between the costco sugar and this sugar and this comes out a lot cheaper for me where I'm at anyways I don't know what the prices would be where you're at you have to check but I get six pounds for three dollars we're over at Costco I get seven pounds for ten dollars so this turns out way cheaper alright guys there we go my uh second Costco haul um, I'm trying a bunch of their brands of stuff so I can see what the family thinks of it because some of the stuff is cheaper at Aldi's so I think I said Costco a second ago I'm at Aldi's uh, the Aldi's brands of stuff um, just to see what my family thinks there are a few things that are cheaper there are a few things that are comp comparable to the other places so I'm gonna find out and figure out which ones work best for my family and my house and change up my shopping schedule and the way I go shopping and yeah I'm really enjoying having an Aldi's in my town all right guys thanks for coming along and we'll see you in the next one and remember stay positive bye